Yes, sir. Yo, you too. Welcome to the great FX TV, man. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. If you're still with the force, just hit that like button and share the video so you can reach as many people as possible, man. With a double piece of productivity and the positivity, guys. I'm back with that. That's great, is it? And I'm back with another banger. So, guys, you know, this is um, one of the easiest strategies. So, this is my Crash 300. You know, um, basically, on this strategy, you don't really, really zoom. You know, uh, I just zoomed just so that you can see properly. You know, because when I'm doing it like this, you're not going to see what I'm basically, you know, talking about. But then when you use it, uh, you're not obligated um, to zoom, right? Um, you're just going to zoom. Uh, I'm just going to zoom just so that you can see properly. Because right here, you see you see only beautiful colors, right? So, if I zoom, you're going to see properly. Okay. So, what do we want? Um, I'll, I'll give you the settings at the end of the video. So, what do we want here? You see, this is crash 300, right? So, we're going to catch spikes with the strategy. So, what do we want? We're going to want for a 200 and 100 EMA cross right here. That's the first thing that you're going to wait for. But then after waiting for that cross, you're going to move, move your screen from left to right to see um, if that cross it is still there, right? You know the rules. Everybody should, should be knowing this by now. All right. So you're gonna wait for that um that cross that doesn't move at all. Yeah, you see it moves from left to right. When I'm talking about moving, um I'm talking about this. Let me show you. Um let me show you this one. You see, um we got a cross right here, right? But look at when I move it to the left hand side. Just look at where it is right now. It should not go to the bottom, it, it has to stay there at the top, right? So we don't want this. You see, um, now it is at the bottom. Look at when I move it to the right hand side. You see, now it is at the top. So we don't want that. So this is what we want. This one. You see that uh, it is on the left hand side, right? You see when I move it from my left to my right, it is still at the top. It is still above level 80. You know, it has to stay above level 80. Okay, cool. You know, that's the rule. You have to get the cross and move it from there to there. After getting that cross, that cross will be caused by these two spikes. You see these ones, these two spikes. Okay, cool. Um, ignore that. After um, getting your cross, you're going to wait. Let me make these thick. Oh, they're already thick. Let me draw a background. Okay, you can see it properly. Um let me change the color a little let me make this um black is it's gonna be all right so okay cool so i'm talking about actually red red will, red will be uh, more visible well it is not visible too so i believe let's see blue let's make it black man let's make it black yes so you, obviously um this cross was caused by these two spikes okay ignore that so meaning the first thing that you're gonna do is to get that cross right after getting that cross um after getting that cross you're gonna wait for the market to retrace here you know after getting that retracement you you will have to make sure that the next spike that comes which is this one you have to make sure that it surpasses this low you know it it like you know it breaks this low i hope you can see you know it breaks this low after it breaks that low you're gonna wait for another retracement which is this one and then on this retracement you're gonna sell so meaning you're gonna sell around this area so let's see this will be your position right here you know this will be your position here and then you see the market went up and then it decided to do what to spike down you were in profit and then after that just look at what it did it decided it wanted to play with you for about you know a few maybe an hour or you know two and then just look at what it did afterwards it dropped so heavily
Just look at it. It dropped so heavily. By here, you would have made around maybe ten thousand dollars. Just look at the drop. Look at look at it. You see you see this job. You see the job. So you could have made about ten k USD or something. So that's a jackpot. Let's look at another one. Uh, okay, let me go to another index. Let me go. I don't want to stick to 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 only um one index. Um. So the first thing it is the cross, right? Oh, we already marked it. Okay, cool. So this is the cross. You get this cross first. Why? Because you see when we move it from the left hand side to the right hand side, the cross remains here on this level, which is level above level 80. Okay, cool. That's the first thing that you get. And then let's look at it. Um, so meaning that cross would be caused by these by this spike actually okay cool after that spike you already know what you're gonna do right you're gonna wait for a retracement here up to here after waiting for this retracement you don't sell immediately you're gonna wait for that retracement after that retracement you're gonna wait for this second spike you have and remember that you have to make sure that that spike surpasses or breaks this level you know this low after um it breaks that low you're gonna sell on this retracement you know and then on this retracement just let's see what the market did let's see okay you you got into profits immediately and then just just look at it you see what the market did it went all the way down and then right here, it wanted to play with you for a couple of minutes. And then it decided to calm down again. You could have made ten thousands of dollars too. You know. So, let me look for another opportunity. Let me look for another opportunity. Okay, this is the cross. This is that right cross. You see, we got that cross, right? And then we move the screen from left to right. Mm, nope. No, that's not a valid one. Let's look at another one. Okay, here's a valid one. You see, you got that cross. You move your screen from left to right. That cross it is still above level 80. After you get in that cross, remember you move your screen, right? After moving your screen, you will just zoom just so that you can see. So meaning this cross, it was cost by this spike this spike right let me see yes it was caused by that spike so after that after the spike that causes the um the cross you're gonna wait for a retracement again after waiting for that retracement you have to make sure that you sell only only if the next spike um surpasses the first one so here's the next spike. Let's see. Did it surpass this one? Nope, it didn't. So you're not going to sell yet. After that, you're going to wait for another spike then. You see, this is the second spike. That's, that's the third spike. So let's check. Did it surpass this spike? Yes. It has to be below that spike, meaning it has to break this low. After that low, You'll be selling on this retracement, you know. After that retracement, that would be your order, and then boom, it crashed. Just look at that. Just look at that. Just look at it, guys. All those spikes. All those spikes. So, yep, let's go to boom now. Let's go to boom. So that's easy, man. But then if you don't understand, but I don't think you won't be able to understand. That's so easy. But if you don't understand, um, you can text me on WhatsApp or you can send an email. You know, um, you can send an email or you can text me on WhatsApp, which is 06 11 579 529 06 11 579 529 that's my whatsapp so okay here's um the cross 
in this case you're gonna have to get a cross right here at the bottom of the screen so after getting that cross remember that now this just be the opposite right so remember that you're gonna move your screen from left and then to your right you have to make sure that the um the cross remain below level 20. after getting that cross that remains below level 20. meaning let me see meaning that cross was caused by this spike i don't know if you can see it this one there's a spike right here i hope you can see it so it was caused by that spike after that spike you want to wait for a retracement and then we do you didn't even get a retracement so after that retracement you have to um wait for the second spike and the second spike has to suppress this first spike the same rules applies right which is so in this case it's gonna be that spike so what you're gonna do you're gonna buy on this retracement you see then on that retracement you bought and then after you bought you see in this case you didn't get so many spikes you got only these two and then the market you know yeah it did give you more spikes but you know the overall you got only these two you know the momentum was not that strong let's look at another one there you go here's another cross you have to make sure that these cross right after they cross you move your screen from left and then to right you have to make sure that this um the cross stays um down there after that you can zoom just so that you can see so meaning this cross was caused by the spike so you're gonna after that spike which is this one um which is the one that caused a cross right you're gonna wait for a retracement after that retracement you have to make sure that um the second spike that comes after this spike um surpasses this high after it surpasses this high you will just um oh it retraced too deep hey i'm not gonna lie it would it would have taken you out right here it would have taken you out just look at this it retraced too deep but if you had a bigger account you can see that it went all the way up after that you see it went all the way up it went all the way up and then you would have ate And then again here's that cross you move your screen from left you see that cross it is still there and then you move it to right you see that cross it is still there after that cross you can zoom just so that you can see i've been explaining this i don't know for the whole 12 minutes for the whole 13 minutes guys i've been explaining the same thing i hope you understand you know so after that cross it's obviously that cross was caused by this um spike right so okay Meaning now you're gonna wait for a retracement right here. After getting that retracement, you have to make sure that the spike, the second spike that comes, it surpasses this high, right? Meaning it breaks this high. So that spike will be this one. So after this spike, this one, after this spike, um, you'll be waiting for this retracement. After this retracement, meaning you would buy around this area, and then you could you would have caught this spike and not only that one the market ended up going up up until here so you'd have caught those spikes and then that's it man um i don't need to go to another boom indices right because i've already explained on boom 1000 and yeah man the other will be the opposite so let me show you the settings so this settings um is it's not really gonna take you time because you know so let's start it's gonna be um the first moving average it's gonna be like just the emas you know the emas is gonna be one you're gonna add the moving average from a moving average one up to moving average 20. so this is how simple it is just make sure that they are in different colors you know so that's easy you're gonna add moving average one and then after moving average one, you're going to be adding, you're going to be adding two. After two, it's going to be three. You see, four, 
and then 5, and then 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, up until 20, but then make sure that they're in different colors. And then after that, you'll be done. After being done, you're going to be adding a stochastic oscillator. Stochastic oscillator, you're going to be, um, K period is going to be 5, D, 3, slow in 3, and then low, high. Make these colors to be white. Make sure that they're in the background of your, um, if you chart, then the levels is gonna be 20 and 80. So that's how simple it is. And then you're gonna click done. After clicking done, you're gonna be adding the first moving average, which is moving average 100. And then, you know, just the EMA. And then after that, you're gonna be adding the second moving average, which is the moving average 200. So if you, um, you didn't catch it, you can just rewind the video. It's gonna be easy, man. And thank you if you stayed up to this far, man. I appreciate you so much. Um, please continue to give me that support. And if you haven't joined my Telegram channel, the link is down in the description box below, man. And yeah, man, we are killing it today. But then besides that, I appreciate you, man. Uh, if you haven't clicked that subscribe button, please do so. And please like the video if you haven't and comment something positive. But not only something positive, just also something that's constructive. You know, maybe you want to ask something, maybe you don't understand this um, um strategy. You can um text me on WhatsApp 0611-579-529. 0611-579-529. And then you can you can um email me if you don't use WhatsApp. Um there's uh there's my email down there. Or you can ask me on the comment section. So you have three options. So yeah, man, thank you, man. I'm out.